Yes. Okay. Hey guys, just come across one and this just popped up. So give me a second. Probably no eyes watching the video with you last night. And I cut the hang of it, but I might forget a little parts. So But is that really like not a really good one? But like it's a good one. I think so. So you're just gonna have this open. You go to FX. Render and clouds. You can pick your color of your clouds, but I just want to pick black. And then you can pick anything you want. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No. Yeah, click on it. This be 6,000. 6,000 by 6,000. Then you click effects. Render and clock. You can change it around to whatever you want. Uh, freeze. Froze. Right there, I find 296. Let's see right there. But you gotta go all the way down. But 26, that's fine. Maybe you can then go to dump and pick your color that you want. I want to pick black. And, um, click CTRL. V. I mean, and then click Control V. Just yeah, copy the same thing so you don't have to do it over again. And if you do it over again, sometimes you don't mess up. But if you're like really good, what the hell is this? What the hell? Thing if it's not already clicked, and we can grab this little part right here. Now, please tell me it's not going to do that thing again. Okay, good. Now, just like match it up. Like, fit it in. Probably not like all the way in. Maybe I'll just slide it out a little bit. There, that's fine. Alright. And then you have to create. 
new layer. You click the dangle box and then highlight the whole thing. Then you go let go. Then you need to go to text and then paste your font. And to me, the best font I would say is 200. I mean, font size. Um, you don't want to play in black because you know the size black. So I heard it's like a um secondary for a photo shop something like that. Then we um we need to go to and reason. Now we need to go to image and rotate ninety clockwise. I don't know the, the other way. There's kind of layers. Because if you just going to rotate the layers. Front number which is a zero and then king is a ninety. And you click it and then and then it's your render. And then you should go over and people are calling me and I'm asking. You have to click the blue arrow, or I just click, and then move it. Ooh. This is a really bad thing that I don't like to use that, and it always freezes. That was A new layer because anytime you need to add new text, you have to have a new layer. And then you're going to do the rectangle again, and you do the same thing. But instead of rotating it on 90 degrees, you're 
rotate it 180 because if you rotate it 90, it's going to turn out just like that. But if you rotate it 180, it'll be the other way, how you're going to want it. But the power, I don't think that'll show. The power part to show. You know, the power part to show. But I don't know what the power to show. You know? <coughs> and then you gotta go to legs. Flip. Slash and zoom. I'm not really good with this right now, but you try to get it once I'm out. You can just like turn it over and have it like that, but I don't think you're going to want to like that. Oh, that would look cool. Yeah, I'm going to keep that. But, uh, I'm going to try to... So you gotta do it by 180 to get it to be the other way. But I want like this. This looks to me it looks cool. If you're like, what the hell, I forgot what you did. You have to go to layers and then go to for horizon. And then you gotta click. And then you gotta click. Like I said, if you go too fast, it's good for us. Like how is this for like right now? Oh, I forgot. I forgot. You need to click the blue too.
fast, but just go back and down with it. But if your name is longer, you know, make it smaller. If I would, if it was smaller, I, what I do, is like, I would make it as small as, like, as small as it could go to fit in the box. And then, like, I would write it like medium, and then like long again, like you know, like a matrix effect, like how it like, go like go down, like do something like that. But we kind of get what I'm trying to mean. Shouldn't be hot for already. You guys do. So that's basically how you make a YouTube banner. Um, I'll try to make an update on how to get like effects, like where your name is. Like, like, an effect you can get on this. Stop, bruh! I said I put it out of there. Oh, whatever, I don't care. Um, so I'm just gonna end it here. Alright, peace out, guys.